What's going on, everybody? It's your partner, Vinny Sake. Yesterday, games. Before I start this video, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, stay up to date with all my motherfucking videos. Follow me on Instagram at Upper Fitness and follow my band, Divided Dimension, on Spotify. This brand is called Only What You Need 20 Grams of Protein. Got an RTD. Yeah. So. Smooth vanilla, 20 grams of protein, plant-based, 180 calories. You have 7 grams of fat, 1 gram of saturated fat, 11 carbs, 5 grams of fiber, 4 grams of sugar, 20 grams of protein. And it is plant-based, pea protein, organic pumpkin seed, organic flax seed. You got some vegetable fiber in here, a little bit of cane sugar, organic sunflower oil, um, a greens blend, monk fruit extract that's sweetened with. Got some spinach in here, kale. Damn. There's all kinds of shit in here. This thing's loaded. By the way, I got this at Vitamin Shop, and they had a sale. It was like, buy a four-pack, get like another four-pack, I think. I think it was buy one, get one four-pack for 12 bucks for four of them. But I didn't know what if I'd like it or not, so I just bought one. And these are expensive single. This was $3.69 by itself. Or you can get a four-pack for 13 bucks. I think. I think it was $12.99. And it was like, buy one, or buy two, get one, or something. And I'm just like, man, I'm not buying fucking three cases of this shit. I don't even know what it tastes like. So $3.69 for this one fucking milkshake, or protein shake. I shouldn't say milkshake, because it's not milk. It's fucking vegan action. So, I can't believe it. I was just like, fucking $3.69. I really wanted to try this, though. Because I really like their bars, and how they're like all organic and shit. And it, it, it seemed like they would be able to make a pretty good protein shake. So I decided to check it out. They do have a bunch of other flavors. They have like a coffee flavor and some other shit. But I figured I'd try out the vanilla and see what happens. I'm not usually a fan of RTDs because I like to make my own shit. Especially because it's fucking expensive. But I did want to try it. So even if, even if this is the best thing I've ever had in my life, I don't see myself purchasing it unless I get a deal. There's no fucking way in hell I'm going to pay almost $4 for a protein shake. That's That's absurdity. That's insanity, absurdity, fucking insane. It's pretty smooth. It is smooth. It says smooth vanilla. It is smooth. There is like a... There is some kind of bite going on. It's got some kind of bite to it. It's not amazing. I can't taste any of the greens though. But there is some kind of like aftertaste bite going on. I don't know if it's stevia. I guess it's not stevia because it's not sweetened with stevia. It's got some monk fruit extract. No dairy, no trees, no peanuts, no soy, no eggs, no vegan, or vegan, no gluten, no dairy, kosher. Non-dairy plant-based, free from 10 top allergies, kale, spinach, and broccoli added. You got some Omega action. This thing is loaded with a lot of shit. It's an okay taste, but then there's like this... Just aftertaste going on. And it's kind of like a... Not a good aftertaste. It's like a bite to it. Something that lingers on your taste buds. It is smooth though. It almost tastes like a regular... Like uh, like a whey vanilla. But that back end is just not pleasant. Initial taste. Decent vanilla. Then it kind of like turns into this... Not so good bite to it. Yeah, it's definitely not worth $4, even if it was amazing. It's okay. I don't think it's amazing, though. I really wish it was, but they it's got some kind of weird aftertaste going on. I don't know. So even if the price point was on point, I don't see myself buying these. I'm not a fan of RTDs in the begin with. Because they're always expensive as fuck and just non-economical, you know? I'm going to give this like a 7.5, maybe 7.
I think seven's fair. I'd definitely drink it again. If you gave me a case of these and said, hey, here you go. I'd be like, thanks, man. Sweet. I'm going to drink these motherfuckers. You ever get something given for free and you don't want it? And then you, it ends up sitting in your closet for like fucking 10 months. And then you're like, oh, I never used that. I definitely would drink this. You know what I'm saying? But it's not something I fucking craving. I'm not like, you know, wanting to drink this. I'm not like fucking, man, I can't wait to like drink that fucking shake again. It's not like one of those. So I'm, I think seven's fair. Um, so that's going to be pretty much it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for the support. As always, let me know what you want to see next. If you like to fucking bad, subscribe, share, like, and comment below. Scroll but don't troll. Hand on him because I'm fucking swole. Don't forget to follow me on my social media. I'm Fitness, Facebook, I'm Fitness, Snapchat, I'm Fitness, Instagram, I'm Fitness. Don't forget to like my band page, Divided Dimension on Facebook. Follow my band, Divided Dimension on Spotify. Shop over some needs at TigerFitness.com. Using my field link, which will be in the description box below. And I'll check you guys later.